Welcome back all my free thinkers to Grow Rich, Grow Happy, the space where our number one goal is to teach you how to accumulate and grow wealth regardless where you are in your journey. Now I'm going to jump right off into my affirmation being that this is the first uh, video of the day because I got some, some I, we got to talk. <laughs> anyway, uh, let's start this off right. To manifest wealth, I put into action the required wisdom. And with that, uh, let's jump over here. <clears throat> let's jump over here to this old uh, BlackRock thing. Uh, if you notice, y'all, uh, well, let me just tell you what's going on. Let me sh let me show you what's happening. H uh, Hedera's H bar doubles on misinterpretation of BlackRock announcement, then falls twenty five cent. This is what I'm talking about with price predictions and how you can go from. Um, you can go from the whole uh, making a prediction and there's some news dropping. Boom. It takes off like yesterday when um, I made the video and um, based on the article, uh, was under the impression that uh, H-Bar and BlackRock was working together. Now, I'm going to tell you something about the way they work articles. But anyway, we're going to get into this right now. Uh, anyway. They fail. The market gave back some of the earlier gains after realizing BlackRock wasn't directly involved in the tokenization on H uh, Hedera's uh, BlackRock. I mean, um, blockchain. Okay, we go down here, and it says here. Here it is. Here's the problem. Sometimes the use of passive voice is just clumsy writing. Other times, it's a grammatical structure to which investors need to pay close attention. Hedera announced. Tuesday that BlackRock's ICS U.S. Treasury Money Market Fund had been tokenized on the Hedera blockchain in collaboration with the, that company, that digital uh, token company, uh, Archex, digital asset company. Uh, Hedera supporters on social media jumped to conclusion, me included, that BlackRock chose uh, Hedera to tokenize its funds and Blockchain's native HBAR token surged over 107%. That's what news would do. That's what news would do. But then we, we come back and it says, but while it was indeed BlackRock's fund that was tokenized, that part was true, it wasn't the world's largest asset manager that did the tokenizing, which could explain why Hedera's announcement carefully said the fund is tokenized not blackrock has tokenized once the market realized this h bar slipped 25 percent again not worried h bar is still a great company and the fact that they were able to do that uh that they did tokenize it you know that's a great thing okay here it is uh the archance ceo graham rockford said that it was indeed an archax choice to put the fund on hedera in response to criticism about misleading uh, marketing from Hedera, so I guess the way we uh, the way it happened is both of these companies and they both were in the article uh, as working together. I guess it was uh, Archax that took the fund to Hedera and tokenized it on Hedera. But it was a BlackRock fund. BlackRock entered the real world asset tokenization uh, sector last month when it um, launched a USD institutional digital uh, institutional digital uh, liquidity fund on Ethereum. And they say that okay, the H bar token is still up by sixty one percent over the uh, twenty four hours, but the two percent market depth um, remains relatively thin. Okay, anyway. Uh, so, everybody was uh, fooled, but that's how it goes in the news, right? Uh, but when I look at this, this is still H Bar. Make no mistake, they are the they are big time. These guys are big time, uh, and I think this pullback just gave you guys an opportunity, really, uh, to get into H Bar because H Bar is still uh, working on things, and as you can see. Uh, the company took that fund over to, uh, they tokenized it on HBAR, on uh, the Hedera network. So if you look here, within the uh, last, what's the, what's the highest we made it last yesterday? That's what I want to see. 
Uh, we got up to 17 cent, which was big. Uh, uh, let's go down a little bit. A little bit. See, but here's the thing. What I don't want people to do, and a lot of people are probably doing this. Oh, they're pissed off, and they're like, oh, I'm, I'm going to... Um, I'm, I'm done with Ace Bar. I'm done with Ace Bar. Don't do that. Don't do that. The uh, the price estimate I gave on these guys, the prediction is still, well, now this just settles back to where I gave it. But now, you know what they always say? All news is good news. <laughs> All news or whatever, something like that. Uh, so any news is, is, is just good news. So what this does, though, is it puts... A spotlight on Hedera, whether it's for good purposes or bad purposes. But I believe that this is all going to still work out in Hedera's favor. Because, hey, now they got something that uh, people are talking about. And at the end of the day, we cannot deny where that um, that market fund was tokenized on Hedera. Let's see if they change anything with... Uh, the reason I'm on their Twitter, guys, I'm, I'm on here to see if they change anything. With what they put out through the last year three, which may help. All right, let's see. Let's see. All right. Let's check this real quick and see. All right. All parties involved were okay. It's right here. This right here. Okay. Uh oh. All parties were. And all parties involved were aware that we were tokenizing on Hedera. We always speak to issuers before tokenizing their asset on chain. Now, I'm going to share this. I am going to share this and I'm going to put, hmm. Because you know what this tells me? This tells me. Based on this, on what they're saying here, what HBAR is saying, BlackRock could have been aware that this was happening all along. Because look what they said. All parties involved were aware that we were tokenizing on Hedera. All parties. Not just them and Chanchax. All parties. This is why it pays to... Uh, do research, do a little bit of digging, because it's right here. They're basically saying, no, nah, we stand by what we said. We always speak to issuers before tokenizing their asset on chain. So that says enough for me right there. And like I said, like I said, this is Chantex. This is Chantex saying that. Uh, I'm follow this guy. But he's saying this. He's, he's basically saying that everyone knew. Hedera. Um, Black Rock, everyone. So, again, this is why it's important to do your homework, guys. But more importantly, uh, this just gives you guys an opportunity, not financial advice, to uh, to uh, maybe grab some H-Bar. I don't know. Whatever you plan to do. But what I uh, also like is this is not done. This is not done. And I really believe that uh, Hedera is still going to come out on top. I believe that, uh, yeah, they're still going to, um, they're going to benefit from this. Mark my words. Anyway, with that being said, good morning. Let's get this rocking.